Sister Nas has joined forces with the NFL Alumni Association. Some of the biggest names in football have signed on to get healthy alongside of America as part of the NFL Alumni Wellness Challenge. So today, we are putting our game faces on and stepping up to make a change. Joining me are NFL greats, Bart Oates, Stephen Baker, Sidney Justin, Lee Rousseau, and Otis Anderson. And they are getting started today. They're already moving with rock star system Oz trainer Purcell Duggar. Because he's here to get him going. There he is. All right, all right, all right, all right. You know, it's hard to get started. I get it. The first steps are difficult, right? Sometimes you have to really envision yourself on the other side. That's why I wanted to bring in one of the NFL's very own, the legendary former linebacker of the Chicago Bears and 1979 Pro Football Hall of Fame inductee, Dick Butkus. He has been on System Oz for six weeks. Listen carefully. He's already lost 31 pounds. Look at those pictures. And my goodness, what a transformation. Dick, I am not only a huge fan. I grew up you know, watching everything you did, but I'm also very proud of you. How does it feel to lose all that weight? Well, I'll tell you what. It, it, it really made, it's made a difference in my lifestyle. Um, you know, I'd say eight out of ten former NFL players probably have a problem with weight afterwards, and they probably have some sort of, you know, some injury. And uh, losing this weight has really helped me just feel a lot better. My quality of life is a lot better. I'm shooting for about, I don't know, eight, ten more pounds to go. So what was the hardest change you had to make, and how did you adjust to ensure that you succeeded? Because you've been pretty good at getting things done in your life. Well, you know what? It, I think... The hardest part about it was uh, cutting back on what I ate. It just it just seemed that when I started reducing what I, the amount of food that I was taking in, the weight started to come off. And also for the last 30 days, I might add, that I've been going through a crisis here with some problems with my home here. And the stress level, I mean, it skyrocketed for me. But what happened, I, you know, before I would probably eat to satisfy myself and get rid of this stress. But instead, I, I, I turned to med uh, meditating, as, as funny as that may sound, and it seemed to work for me. I've gone through this crisis, and we resolved the crisis here at home, and I feel terrific right now because I see that weight coming down, and i got no other worries but just keep on working hard at it. The idea yeah. of the ferocious Dick Buckus meditating, I want a picture. <laughs> I, I, I know, it sounds funny, but, you know, ever since I had my heart uh, bypass, uh, like 20 years ago, I was trying to get into meditation a little bit just to relieve the stress because, uh, you know, I worry about everything. And I think the stress thing is very important, and that's where meditation comes in for me, at least, and I'm sure other guys should, should really try it because uh, it's worked for me, and I know it'll work for them. Well, that's why I made it a big part of System Oz. So let me ask you, as the, as, the, as the pro here, literally, any words of advice for your fellow NFL alums and everyone starting System Oz at home? Well, I, I just think, the, you know, that they should go after it, and, you know, and because, you know, the Oz system is heart-healthy, and because of our Takes Heart program, uh, for myself at least, I was trying to eat healthy. It's trying to eliminate really stress and reduce the calories. And if you can do that, I think, uh, and that's what you do with the eye system, and I think when they do that, they'll see results and quickly. I wanted to mention you ought to be commended for what you do. You've saved probably millions of lives and you've improved the quality of millions of people. And it proves to me that there still are good people in this country. Dick, thank you very, very much. You're very kind to say that. We'll be right back. All right. All right.